What's going on guys? Today we're back with another video and we have day two of gutting the tracker. You can see I've made a little bit more progress since the last video. I did a little couple things off camera. We got the we got the live well out, that floor that was in here where you know all the batteries were. But we have a little bit more to get this back deck out. You can see this piece of aluminum right here. We're actually gonna leave that in and just cut it down to where we're gonna be framing, but we need to get these two side pieces out, and they are filled with old pour foam. So this is not going to be super easy. What I think we're going to have to do is we're just going to take the grinder, cut it off right there, pull that piece off, and just start chipping away at the pour foam until we can get this, this top piece out. And then, you know, all that will go. But that is probably going to be today's video. I'm hoping to have this thing basically completely gutted by the end of today. That would be two days into gutting. Um, and then we got the transom work, like I kind of mentioned in the last couple videos. That that's the next big thing after the the gut and then paint. Just imagine this thing, brand new white paint. But with that said, guys, I'm gonna get the GoPro on and uh, let's get let's get at it. Maybe I could just pull it out now. Need pliers. It's gonna be way too hot. Alright guys, it is actually the next day. I wasn't able to finish getting all this out, um, so we're going to go ahead and finish that today, and then I think we're going to wrap the video up after that. We got that side out, but we have to get the foam out still, and then we have this side, but I know how to do it, so it shouldn't take too long to get this out, and then we got to, you know, tackle, tackle all that foam. So with that said, I'll throw the GoPro back on, and we'll get at it.
Alright, so we got the, the, the metal plates off. This thing is basically gutted. I just have to get the rest of this foam out. I actually used a shovel. As you guys probably saw, it was actually really efficient. I just got all this out in like five minutes, if that. So I gotta get a garbage bag, start putting all this stuff in there. Then we can finish getting the rest of the stuff that's, you know, still in there out. And, uh, yeah, it that went a lot better than I thought it would. So, with that said, let's get the garbage bag. Alright guys, that is the completed gut. You guys can see all up down there. We gotta take two more pumps out, but we aren't gonna do that right now. These, um, we added just because in the next video we're gonna be taking this transom off. I'm actually gonna be doing that in like 10 minutes. But, uh, I wanted to wrap this video up for you guys. It's completely gutted. And, uh, we actually did get the motor off. I didn't film that, sadly. Um, you know, we built a stand and we actually installed a hoist to lift it but if you guys want more information on that I can kinda go over that and of course I'll probably film putting it back on we're just trying to figure it out for ourselves on how to get that whole thing out so I didn't really film that but uh, I probably should have um, but with that said guys you know here it is that's what we're working with we have a little bit of foam up here that I'm probably gonna end up taking out I just didn't want to take it out only because I'm not sure what I'm doing with this area yet so I left it in because this is good foam um, that doesn't need taken out quite yet. Uh, we gotta get this carpet off too, but besides that, you know, it's gutted. That's the boat. It's all good. But, uh, let me just wrap this video up, guys, and, uh, we'll call it here. Guys, I'm just gonna go ahead and wrap it up first today, you know. I think we got a lot done. Um, it is a couple days later, so it's not like I just finished it, but, uh, if you guys wanna see more of this kind of series that I'm doing with this boat, please comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.